拜拜啦，喺直播室嘅嘉賓咧就係地就係珠玉地產服務 Crab Banker 嘅文文華小姐 ，Hello Tina 你好，打聲招呼先。Hello 你好。喺電話裏邊咧接通咗另外一位嘉賓嘅，就新進屋泰華嘅，就係、是、加拿大啊多層柏文業主協會嘅主席 Mr. Tony Joanto。咁啊，阿 Tony 咧而家喺屋泰華，不過今日咧。佢又喺八點幾啦，嗰邊嘅時間啊，咁都好榮幸邀請到佢同我哋一齊做節目。講啲咩題目呢？咦，同頭先四點鐘你發現啊，有少少類似，亦都有啲咧好好好相同嘅嘅問題啊。Yes. 即係講下咧啲共管物業有嗰個保險費，哇，大幅飆升。咁我哋所知道咧，有啲大廈咧就而家個保險費啊，哇，原本八萬加到廿四萬。有啲係九萬啊，加到三啊萬，咁就佔底費咧。有啲係原本啊一千一萬咁啊上啦，有啲二萬五，有啲係三十萬六十萬都好似話聽聞啊，咁真係咪啦？所以今日咧就揾阿 Tony 同我哋傾下呢個問題嘅。Yeah, Tony, thank you so much for、uh, sharing your insights and taking your evening、um, times、uh, to、uh, to be with us with、uh, our Vancouver. Uh, Chinese community and、uh, our AM thirteen twenty listener. So、um, you have been very busy、uh, doing a lot of talks on this insurance, the Strata insurance, in the past few months. But obviously, recently,、uh, all the news is now focusing on the the coronavirus. So kind of like you know, like the the Strata in situations, it seems like you know, like in the back of the pie right now.、Mm. So we would like to take this、uh, opportunities to talk to you, hope because you have a little bit more time, and and actually share with us,、uh, get more into the informations. So,、uh, what do you think? Now, first, we need to do a translation. Yeah, he has to translate it. Then, first, Tina has already introduced Tony. Then, we are also very grateful to Tony. Then, today, in the Black Hole, we are going to spend time to talk about the new coronavirus. Now, the new coronavirus is coming. 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 Tony 嘅意見咁啊，阿 Tina 咧會英文同我一齊即係傾偈啦。我就以廣東話咧就翻譯翻阿 Tony 嘅問阿阿 Tina 個問題嘅嚇。Okay, so Tony, let's let's get started. And、uh, okay, so the first question is about、uh, the natural disaster. You know, we understand that the natural disasters like the earthquake risk and the、uh, and the number of insurers,、uh, you know, willing to take on the policy for BC condo is decreasing. Are、uh, the reasons why the rate went up anywhere from fifty? To three hundred percent, so、uh, and the deductibles are going from the conventional ten thousand, twenty five thousands to like a hundred thousand, two hundred fifty and six hundred thousands. I've heard. So is the rest of the country doing the same thing? If not, why? And if yes, why? Can you share that with us, please, Tony? Yes.、啊这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这个这
。OK， so 誒、uh, 誒、uh, Tony 嘅意思咧就係話咧，因為咧我哋喺北美裏邊咧，我哋其中一個誒、uh, 一個城市咧係有即係、就是、最多誒誒、uh, condo apartment 嘅，咁所以咧每個月咧都差唔多咧有人即係、就是、有有有呢啲咁嘅 condo 嘅 building 咧係需要誒、uh, 續保啊咁樣樣嘅。OK， yes。So while there are major increases for a number of the condos, and mostly high rises, very large developments for communities that are getting older and their buildings are in disrepair, we also have quite a number of communities in the province who've had very modest or moderate increases. OK， 咁咧，阿 Tony 嘅意思咧就係話咧，雖然有誒誒咁多啦，但係個誒即係聽起嚟咁多，但係咧，因為咧有好多啲誒，無論係社區嗰啲又好啦，或者係大型嘅大廈啦，誒、呃、啊，佢哋嗰啲物業咧都越嚟誒、呃、越嚟越舊啦。OK， 咁所以咧亦都係個維修咧就唔係真係做得咁好啊。咁但係咧就亦都有好多啲咧，只不過係即係係好 modest 嘅，即係喺中即係唔係話即係起得咁緊要咁樣樣咯。OK，carry、okay, on please。So the、um, insurance industry is in a very difficult time right now because the number of insurers—these are the companies who actually provide the insurance—who、yes. were writing insurance for Br- British Columbia、um, has either reduced or their ability to take on the increased number of claims and liabilities has been reduced. So there is. So there's much less competition, which is one of the factors causing an increase in cost. OK， so 阿 Tony 嘅意思咧就即係話咧，因為誒而家越嚟越少保險公司啊，誒、mm. 呃、就所以變咗咧，即係嗰個誒係啦，咁、呃、所以咁嘅情況之下咧，誒、呃、嗰、那個保險費咧好明顯地咧就係加咗上去咯，加咗上去嘅。OK， yes， thank you。Okay， so、uh, so the things the insurance companies and the brokers look at now. Is they look at the recent claims history, the age of the building, the condition of the building, the type of construction, and how large the risk might be because it might be a very large development. Okay, so um, his 嘅意思咧就即系话咧，而家佢哋点样嚟到去去关于关于呢个续保啊，或者系诶点样去即系诶诶会做呢个新嘅保险又好定点好咧？就系最紧要咧，第一去睇下咧，你过去咧你栋大厦咧系有冇 claim 过呢啲咁嘅保险？有冇杀伤？系啦，有冇杀伤咧？第二咧嗰个大厦嘅年纪啦，第三。啊，個樓齡啊，樓齡，對唔住啊，樓齡啊。OK， 第三咧就係嗰個大廈嗰個誒 condition， 即係狀況。多謝你啊。咁然之後咧就係誒佢哋誒究竟係木樓啊，定係水泥樓啊，定係即係究竟係點樣嘅嘅結構係點樣樣咧？另外咧就係佢哋睇嗰個風險啦，有幾大啦？咁或者有啲係成個大嘅社區嘅，咁或者有啲係細嘅咁樣樣啦。OK， that's great。And、um, so I mean are they are they the same？ Is it is it？ Just BC. I mean, how about Ontario? And is there anything else you want to add on?、Um, uh, plus, plus, you know, like how does it compare to Ontario, Alberta, and all the other provinces? So I let、uh, Aiken to translate that. 呢個情況咪就係 BC 省啦。咁嗰陣時同埋亞山情況點樣？可唔可以同我做做同我哋做一個比較咧 ？Yes. So you can carry on from the previous one. Yes. Okay. Okay. So, so one of the as we know up until recently. Um, Vancouver and Vancouver Island have been one of the most expensive real estate markets in、yes. North America, but also the cost of construction has been one of the highest in North America as well.、Ah. So it's not so it's not just the、um, it's not just the、uh, risks like the age or claims history or condition of the building or type of construction. But it's also related to that the cost to rebuild or replace these buildings has、oh. dramatically increased. Oh, and okay. That, and that, of course, just by itself, has forced the cost of insurance to increase. Oh dear. So that that is. To me, that will be a major reason. So, ah,、uh, 嗱，阿、uh, Tony 嘅意思咧就係話咧就誒誒、呃，因為我哋啊温哥華啦、BC 省啦，同埋誒 Victoria 誒誒誒維多利亞嗰邊啦，維多利亞，<笑>我哋嗰個物業咧嗰、那個價錢咧就係越嚟越貴，越嚟越貴。咁但係咧，雖然咧就即係喺北美裏邊咧，差唔多係最貴嘅誒，即係其中一個最貴嘅誒誒市場啦。咁但係咧，另外一樣嘢咧就點解令到呢啲保險費咁高咧？就係、是、因為咧佢嗰個成本啊，結起屋嗰個成本係越嚟越貴。Yeah. Now,、uh, can I ask you one thing? 
um, because we're gonna be um, having our commercial right now. So I'm gonna ask that questions right after our commercial. How about that? Yeah, yeah, that'd be great. That would be great. So, Tony, I just want to let you know that we are on FaceTime right now, uh, Facebook Live. So we're on Facebook Live. So it's, although we're doing the uh, commercial, but actually we're st we're still interacting right now. Uh, there are com uh, there are uh, realtors on the show uh, on the Facebook Live at uh, the Vancouver Real Estate Board is watching our uh, conversations right now, our interview. So uh, that is a very good um, uh, point. That um, so, do you think that? Um, it's not do you think you just mentioned that the cost of constructions actually in yeah, that's one of the reason what if you rate one to ten you know to cost this expensive insurance this cost of instruction is between one to ten where where does it play I think it's about a five I think it's half of half of the reason why insurance has increased so much because the insurance cost for the last five years didn't increase because of competition it kept the price down but what happened was the cost of construction replace of the replacement of the buildings increased by about 10 to 15 percent every year and suddenly this year everybody has been forced to catch up by the insurance industry okay so another thing that i want to let me just try to see uh when uh aiken aiken Take a look at it. Yes, sorry. So I just want to find out that when is our uh, commercial break is going to be over, and uh, so because we want to uh, the um, uh, Chinese listener to to hear this part as well, uh, because I'm doing this on uh, you know like. Yeah, on the yeah. Um, on the li uh, Facebook live like that. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> so we're trying to, you know, do the radio things at the same time where we're trying to carry on the conversation because this is the part that I don't need to translate because this is the part that I would like our realtors to understand what Tony is is uh, sharing with us. So the main thing that uh, someone that just joined, maybe Ashley Smith, I see you just joined and things like that. Thank you for watching. Is is the constructions, the cost of constructions. Uh, and makes our insurance goes up that much higher. Now, um, do you think that you know, like I, as as you know, that the government has has come up with a lot of different costs to make the constructions um, gone up, uh, go up quite a bit. Um, is is this? I I don't want to say is this politics or not. So now we're coming back in two seconds for the radio shows, and then I'm I'm gonna translate it. 好，翻嚟第二節嘅投資金業今日嘅嘉賓啊，就係直播室嘅專業地產服務區賓強嘅麥文華小姐啦、千娜啦。電話裏邊咧就係多層拍文業專業會主席啊，咁啊 Tony Jovento 啊。咁啊頭先喺第一拍裏邊咧都講緊咧，再多層拍文嗰個誒嘅保險啊，而家都好貴咁啊，講緊咧就全國嘅情況嘅。繼續問問題啦。Okay, now Tony, um. Um, during our commercial breaks, we mentioned about the cost of construction. Um, so my question is, um, you know, like since we have our current government, uh, we have different types of, you know, like development costs, the community costs, and all that, uh, and add on top, and 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 that's why, in 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 my opinions, um, we will never have affordable housing. In Vancouver, I I don't know if I'm correct or not correct, but based on all the costs on it, now, uh, do you think that if the government is willing to make some adjustments, or the government and the developers, you know, we can you know all work together, um, can potentially bring this, or is there a solution at all since the construction cost is so high? So I let Akins to translate that. <coughs> 一個係誒，即係一個物業可能最貴啊嘅嘅嘅嘅成分之一，但係亦都有不同嘅成本嘅，咁啊令到咧阿天啊覺得咧就温哥華咧，所以嗰啲嘅可負擔房咧就唔係太多啦嚇，甚至係好添啊。咁如果喺呢個誒大廈嗰個保險問題裏邊咧，如果家即係政府啊喺誒一啲條例方面啊做一啲調整啊，或者發展商能夠大家配合。Yes, Tony. Thank you. Okay. So, so yes, um, uh, it certainly um, is a cost for reconstruction, for insurance, for new construction. But it's not the provincial government that is the cost. The cost is at a local government level. So the local cities are the ones who are imposing significant costs. For redevelopment, for construction, for permits, and the process is very long, which yes. is very costly for developers. 
Yes. Um, that's where the that's where the problem is. It's not at a provincial government. It's at a local government problem. Okay, great. Let me translate that. So, uh, Tony 嘅意思咧就唔係我哋省政府嘅問題嘅，係、mm. 我哋市政府嘅問題。因為市政府咧就誒、呃、第一啦，佢嗰、那個誒、呃、批嗰、那個。誒、uh, 誒、uh, development 個 permit 咧就好鬼耐嘅時間，發展許可係啦，咁然之後咧就再加上咧每一個嗰啲 permit 啊，或者即係每一個誒、呃、每步驟咧都非常之誒、呃，即係即係加咗人加咗人工又好，加咗總之個成本又多咗啦。咁所以咧佢嘅意思咧就誒係、呃、個市政府嘅問題，就唔係嗰個誒、呃、省政府嘅問題嘅。Mm. So 啊、uh, ，why don't we let's go to the next、um, topic is about a risk management。And maintenance, and apparently this is a hot topic. So you know, like this is a long topic too. So we only have so much time. So can we give us? Can you give us some、uh, bullet point? You know the key things so that you know、um, uh, we we should know. I mean, as as a realtors,、uh, myself, and you know, like our community as well as the、uh, homeowners. And how can we handle this? So I let、uh, Aiken to translate that into Cantonese. So, 嚟到咧個比較大嘅話題咧，一個叫個風險管理 risk management 同 maintenance 即係保養啦。咁啊，以阿天娜係個地產從業員啦，或者社區嚟講，或者個業主嚟講，其實喺呢方面可以知道啲乜嘢嘅資訊咧？嚇，係關於係風險管理同埋保養方面。Yes, Tony. Uh, so, um, uh, risk management is probably um the best solution. Against increasing insurance prices,、um, because the condition of a building and the recent claims history are the two biggest factors the insurance companies and the brokers are looking at when they are renewing the insurance for our property. Okay, so let me translate that. 誒呢個風險評估啊，正所謂風險嘅誒誒，我哋點樣去可以令到我哋嗰個保險費可以即係誒唔上升得咁緊要咧？就係第一嗰個物業嗰個誒 condition 係咩啊？誒狀況狀況，多謝你。另外咧就係、是、嗰個物業咧有冇 claim 到，即係永遠都知啦。係你有冇殺上過咧？你揸車又好啊，如果你真係撞咗車，即係你一殺上過嘅時候，你保險費咧就會加噶啦。Okay, yes, thank you. And the next one. So the most important thing that communities do、um, is that they properly inspect, maintain, and repair all their building components before they fail. So that'll be things like their roofing. Their building exterior siding, their elevators, their hot water and cold water piping,、um, their drainage systems in their buildings—those、uh, components that are the most common cause of insurance claims are the ones that are the greatest threat to increased insurance costs. Hmm. OK， 咁咧，阿 Tony 嘅意思咧就即係話咩咧？啊，你要即係、就是、你個你你你要做個保險啊，或者你去再去續保嘅時候咧，你之前咧一定要搞好幾件事。第一咧就係、是、你嗰、那個誒、呃、維修狀況啦，誒、呃、維修狀況就咩咧？睇睇下嗰個屋頂係點樣樣啦，個外牆啦，誒、呃、你嗰個電梯啦，誒嗰啲喉管啦，誒同埋嗰啲誒去水管啦，呢幾樣嘢咧就係、是、令到嗰、那個啊、呃、保費咧係會誒。呃急劇增加嘅，咁如果你可以誒誒、呃，你用大廈嗰個物業管理公司嘅時候咧，誒、呃、或者成個 council 咧，可以注重呢幾最之依啲嘢嘅時候咧，你就會令到你嗰個保費咧就可以減低嘅。Mm. Yes, so yes, I'm listening. <laughs> yes, so, so this is so this is a historic problem in British Columbia because what we're balancing is housing affordability versus the real cost of operation. Oh. And in British Columbia, because the price of real estate is so high,、mm -hmm. um, and because people carry such large mortgages because of the price of real estate,、mm -hmm. they tend to approve the much lower、um, monthly strata fees than the other parts of the country.、Uh, and the problem with that is, and right now when we're going through the crisis, we can see this as a problem, is because there isn't enough money. To properly maintain and repair buildings in annual budgets, and、okay. but the problem the other side is to increase the strata fees to an affordable level so there is enough money. It suddenly is too costly for people. So we have a very difficult balance that we have a problem with. Okay, so、uh, yes, let me quickly translate. 其實最主要嚟講咧，就係因為咧，我哋以因為我哋嘅物業太貴啊，所以咧就好多時咧就即係你點樣去平衡嗰、那個。誒、呃、預算啊，同埋預算嘅都誒、呃、平日平衡嗰，即係你個 cost of operation 啦、嗯，即係你你要運即係係啦，因為因為你每一個 strata 嘅時候咧，其實你都係一個啊。呃
即係好似有一個生意咁樣樣㗎，因為我哋把誒俾嗰啲咁嘅管理費啦，咁即係好似你俾完管理費係點樣去使咧？咁呢啲管理費嘅時候咧，咁因為我哋個業誒嗰、呃那個物業價錢咧就越嚟越高啊，咁所以變咗咧就嗰、那個誒、呃、我哋點樣去平衡啦？嗰、那個誒 affordability 啦，誒即係可負擔能力啦，同埋嗰個點樣去運誒誒運營啊、營運啊、營運呢、這個啊啊呢個 strata 咁樣樣。咁誒誒再加埋咧就係、是、因為咧誒個物業價錢太高嘅時候咧，令到咧好多人本身嗰個 mortgage 咧就已經係好高。咁所以咧好多 strata 咧就佢哋嗰個 strata fee 咧就 keep 住佢低啲，咁呢個就係我哋而家現時嘅誒喺有有個即係一個困狀就喺度啦。咁所以變咗咧就誒，因為以前因為我哋個物業咁高嘅時候咧，好多時咧我哋嘅管理費咧就偏低。咁你偏低嘅情況之下咧，就會令到同我哋好似其他嘅啊啊其他嘅省份啊，佢哋就唔同。咁變咗咧，我哋嗰個誒錢咧就唔夠去做嗰個維修誒，同埋嗰個誒誒保誒保養。咁令到咧就即係。我哋而家就有呢個咁嘅問題咁樣存在啦。Okay, so、uh, Tony, um, now shall we move on to the insurance situations, or you would have more for、uh, to share with us about this risk management and maintenance? Well, there's one more point about risk management and maintenance,、um, and I think every realtor and everyone in the province understands this. If you were look, if you're looking for a unit in an older building. Um, that probably is a larger unit,、um, but it's not—it's not modernized, it's not updated. You're probably going to be getting into a building that requires a fair amount of maintenance and cost.、Um, but the strata fees are probably lower, as well as the price of the unit. Those are some of the highest risk buildings for insurance renewals right now. Okay. Because the buildings, because the buildings are in need of major upgrades, and if the if the strata has not done major upgrades, they're facing some of the highest insurance increases. Okay, so、uh, let me just quickly translate that. Ah, because ah 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 Tony's 嘅意思咧就即系话咧，啲嗰啲旧嘅 building， 有啲话三四十年嗰啲 building 嘅时候咧，啊或者诶诶诶，佢哋嗰啲单位亦都多啦。咁好多时咧，因为你个 building 系旧嘅时候咧，你可能系嗰个诶 lobby 啊，有好多地方咧，你都系唔。唔唔 modernize 嘅，即係即係未裝未未係未未裝修過啊咁樣樣，咁咁嗱嗰度又要做嘢咯喎，可能你想話、嗯、哦誒、呃、地氈又換下，誒、呃、油油換下，所有啲嘢又換下，咁咧但係因為你咁樣換下嘅情況之下咧，咁你嗰個有一筆。錢啦，咁但係另外一樣嘢咧，就係、是、嗰、那個誒誒誒維修嗰個價錢，誒即係個維修嗰啲錢亦都唔夠，因為個 maintenance fee 個 low 誒係一個 low 嘅 strata fee， 咁所以變咗咧就即係有呢呢咁嘅情況之下，喺個驗收公司嘅誒眼中咧，呢個係一個係 high risk 嘅 building 嚟嘅 ，high risk 嘅 building 嚟嘅。Now um before I get into the、uh, insurance situations, just based on what Tony you just told us, uh older building then because of all the uh, 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 information that you just mentioned. Uh, we do see、um, like downtown uh, uh, that I know that the downtown、uh, insurance company,、uh, sorry,、uh, Strata Building, the younger building. They're not older, like thirty, forty years old building.、Uh, there are other buildings that they're younger.、Uh, they are unable to get insurance. So, I mean, I don't expect you to have an answer why they are like that. But again, when you face that situations, what can you? You know, like、uh, speculate why they are unable to get insurance. 嗯，咁啊個問題啦，咁啊阿 Tina 話咧喺譬如我哋温哥華嘅市中心咧，有啲比較樓齡新啲嘅大廈， mm-hmm. 即係唔係三十三四十年樓嗰啲啊，係啦， yeah, yeah. 都好、yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah. 難揾到一個現數去買一個大廈嗰個保險㗎。咁啊想問問阿阿阿 Tony 啊，即係請教佢啦，究竟佢估計其實點解有啲咁嘅原因，有啲年輕啲嘅樓齡新啲嘅大廈都買唔到啲保險咧？咩、yes. 原因咧？ So yeah, it, it, that is very true. There are some new buildings that either have extremely expensive insurance or they have limits on their insurance. Maybe they're only capable of getting 60% or 40% of their insurance coverage.、Um, for the buildings having difficulty getting insurance,、uh, if you look closely, you're going to find they've probably had a number of claims in the last five years, and those claims have probably been fairly expensive. And that makes them a much higher risk.、Uh, you know, if you're an insurance company, you're selling a product to a co- to a client, which you hope you will take a profit from. If you're selling it to a client who has a history of claims, you're not probably going to be able to make a profit or even break even. 
So you have to raise the price of the insurance and the deductibles to make this more affordable. Uh, the other problem we have with some of the downtown buildings um, is some of them are so large that the value to replace those buildings is getting close to a half a billion dollars. Okay. And that amount with, with a few number of insurers is getting extremely difficult to find policies for them. Okay, so uh, right now we have a commercial coming up, so I will translate that afterwards. Yes, hi Tony. So while we're in the, in the middle of the commercial, I would like to ask you that, carry on with that, that conversation, is that for that situation, so what, what can we do? So, so they cannot, those kind of buildings, they cannot get insurance. What is going to happen? Yeah, well, so far we've managed um, working with the brokers and the brokers working with the insurers. So far they've managed to get insurance for almost all of the buildings, but but they may they may end up with some sort of loss limit. So they may have only been able to get insurance for a portion of the value, not a hundred percent of the value. Um, and so that's the that's a negotiation that needs to take place with the insurance broker and the strata council. One of the one of the problems that we see is that the strata councils are not speaking directly to their brokers. Okay, so we're on the on the uh, we're coming back in two seconds. So I'll okay. carry on. Yeah. 好,回到第三節的投資,今天的剛剛在休息之前,聽到一個問題,就關於一些樓齡比較新的大廈,為什麼都買不到這些好險呢?通常有去過見解喎。Yeah, sorry, so I have to um, um, translate that into quickly uh, uh, Chinese first, uh, Cantonese first, Tony. Uh, so, uh, Tony的意思就是因為有些就算是後生的,他可能過去五年他 咁令到佢哋呢,或者呢,佢哋嗰度係啦,驚個保險,對唔住啊,驚個保險。咁然之後呢,就嗰個,呃,個情況呢,就可能亦都係呢,有個可能性呢,就係佢嗰個成棟大
升到十萬、二十五萬、五十萬，佢上個禮拜最勁嗰個咧就七十五萬。咁但係誒佢咧就睇到咧就點解會係咁樣樣咧？就是、因為咧嗰等大鞋又好點都好啦，即、就、係、是、過去咧嗰一年咧就有三個 claim， 我記三個 claim， 咁然之後咧就、呃、可能咧有多啲嘢就係咩咧？如果佢哋嗰個 piping 啦，誒佢哋冇去去誒係啦，冇、呃、repair 或者 replace。去去換啦，即係因為咧，一棟大廈裏面咧，我哋可能十零廿年咧，我哋啲水喉管咧就會即係、呃、需要去誒、呃、去換噶啦。啊，咁所以變咗咧，如果佢你冇做依樣嘢，亦都有冇、呃、有冇做到其他啲嘅時候咧，所以令到你佢嗰個墊底費咧就係、是、極之高昂嘅。OK， so、um, what can they do？ <笑> I guess my question is that do you know if that building is able to get、um, insurance？ When they get seven hundred and fifty thousand dollars deductible? Yeah. Uh, for 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 um homeowners, they 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 insurance available for a hundred, two hundred and fifty, and five hundred thousand dollars. It does cost substantially more, but it is available. But what they can do is the Strata Council needs to talk directly with the broker. No, nobody in between. And find out why these are the costs, and then try and solve the problem so that in the next coming years they can get their deductibles to come down again. Okay. Now my questions before I translate it: Who is that person in between? Because you said the Strata Council needs to directly talk to the broker. Who is that in between that we need、mm. to eliminate? Mm. Uh, mm. Not, not, not eliminate,、um, but they, but the council needs to speak directly with the broker because oftentimes. The council just lets the property manager renew the policy, but there's no discussion as to why there are differences in the policy. Ah,、uh, okay. 即係問到啦，因為喺佢阿阿 Tony 話咧，喺 Strata Council 即係嗰個誒業主攬發團啦，要同嗰個 broker 即係經紀去講啦。直接講。係直接講，但係中間用用咩人可以嚇即係？我而家原來知道嗰個中間人係邊個啦。邊個啦？係啦。中間咪就係管理公司咯。Okay. 係啦，咁咧就誒阿 Tony 嘅意思咧就話咧，你身為嗰個業主嘅時候咧，其實咧你係可以申請到誒。十萬去到又得，廿萬、廿五萬去，甚至到五十萬咧，你都係可以保到嘅。只不過咧，個 Strata Council 嘅時候咧，就立案法團係咪？我哋所謂嘅係業主立案法團咧，就唔好去俾嗰、那個誒、呃、property management company， 即係嗰、那個誒物業管理公司，去同呢啲經紀講，即係呢啲咁嘅現收經紀講，要係立案法團直接。去同呢啲經紀公司誒誒呢啲誒保險經紀講，咁去問清楚究竟點解會係咁貴咁樣樣嘅。Okay, great. That is a great、uh, point、uh, for us to understand. And anything else?、Uh, bef- um, yeah. Yeah, I I think it, just to to add a little bit to that, it's important to include your property manager in the process. But what's more important is that your insurance broker. Actually, comes to your strata and talks to your strata council and your owners. Okay,、uh, that will be bet-、uh, during our.、Uh, sorry, sorry、yeah. to interrupt. Is it during our、uh, strata council meeting? Exactly. So that, or even the annual general meeting, so that the so so、uh, the owners and the council understand why this is happening. O.K. 誒咁啊，阿 Tony 嘅意思咧就即係話咧，呢啲咁嘅誒保險經紀個誒公司嘅時候咧，佢哋應該喺我哋嗰個年會嘅時候啊，就誒、呃、當我哋大家開年會嘅時候咧，而即係我哋中國人咧，多數都唔去開會嘅。O.K. 呢樣嘢咧係非常之唔啱嘅。咁我哋咧就要去你你個個月唔去唔緊要，個年會你一定要去。即係週年大會。係啦，週年大會個我哋嘅 A.G.M. 嘅週年大會你一定要去。咁所以咧就嗰個誒保險公司咧就會嚟到同大家講解釋點解咧嗰個保險費咧會係升。得咁緊要嘅 ，OK。So um yes. So if that is the case, shall we move on to the next questions, or you have more to、uh, add on? There's one more point that every person who owns a condominium needs to know that if your insurance deductible, let's say, increases to two hundred and fifty thousand dollars for water claims, and you have done something, or your tenant has done something. Or as a result of your being responsible for a claim from your unit, maybe your、um, refrigerator ice maker failed, or your bathtub overflowed. If something like this has happened, you, the owner of that strata lot, may very likely have to pay that two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Oh my God! Very important 
you go out and get insurance to cover that. 嗯，阿姐啱啱就問啦，誒喺其他嘅問題誒之前咧，阿 Tony 會唔會有喺呢個墊底費方面再啲其他補充？咦 ，Tony 有一個好嘅建議俾呢啲業主聽下喎。嗯，佢話你嘅意思咧就即係話，當你如果你嗰個誒公司誒誒誒即係嗰個保險嘅時候咧，可能係去到二十五萬啊咁樣樣嘅情況啦，即係墊墊底去到二十五萬咧。而家最主要咧就係話我哋做誒業主嘅。或者我哋係租客嘅，咁如果嗰、那個誒誒嗰個 claim 啊，係因為我哋嘅單位誒、呃、整即係即係令到咧係有呢個 claim 嘅時候咧，無論我哋係即係可能誒、呃、個個雪，你知而家啲雪櫃咧又有啲冰，即係可以搞，嗯、即係有有有搞冰嗰啲出嚟啦，或者咧你嗰、那個誒浴、呃、缸啦，誒、呃、誒或者你嗰、那個誒、呃、洗衣機啊、乾衣機啊、洗碗機，總有漏水。因為咁嘅情況之下漏咗落去樓下，咁呢個 claim 咧係因為係你個單位嘅時候咧，好大可能性咧，你嗰個業誒立案法團咧嗰個廿萬嗰個 claim 咧就會係叫你即係、就是、我哋做業主嘅咧去俾噶啦。咁所以呢個咁嘅情況之下咧，我哋做業主嘅咧就一定要係去、呃、去買個保險咧，就係、是、可以即係、呃就是、cover 到我哋咧去到嘅二十五萬嘅。So Tony, I want to ask you one more thing is that you know most of the tenants they don't buy Insurance, unfortunately. Okay, so how does that affect? Because they don't buy, and then we don't. I mean, obviously, we in you know, there's, we always ask them to buy, but we can you know some of the time we cannot insist them buy. Or maybe some of the unit right now is doing Airbnb or short term rentals or furnished rental and things like that. And and then if if something happened, uh, flooding, things like that. So so. What can we do? 嗱，佢話聽人話咧，好多嘅即係大部分租客咧都唔會買一個家居保險嘅，自己唔買㗎。咁我哋都可能一啲問題咧，可能佢住嗰度 Airbnb 咧短期租約嘅啫。咁因為咧，雖然叫可以叫佢哋買，但係唔能夠話硬性規定一定要佢買嘅。好啦，咁啊，萬一出事啦，好，譬如漏水啊，嚇，咁啊水浸啦，啊個單位水浸啦，咁點算咧？個業主係租客喎，住喎，唔係業主住喎。Yes, so Tony, please. So, are you including tenants in the same term as owners? Because tenants cannot buy insurance for a straddle loss.、That's、Absolutely, yes, correct, correct. Right? Yes. Okay. So,、um, so you're you're talking about owners who live in buildings. Yes. Who yes. Buy insurance. Okay.、Right? Now, yes, yes, I correct. Yes. Okay. So in that case, so, that you know, as a as a landlord, and then、yeah. and then and then a homeowner, right? Yes.、Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Many. You're you're right, and this is a problem. Also, is that many landlords and owners who live in their units don't buy homeowner insurance, which also reduces the pool of people purchasing insurance in the industry, which places more pressure on the larger insurance companies.、Um, that's another problem. But if you don't buy insurance to cover this type of loss, the Strata Corporation can still go to the Civil Resolution Tribunal or the courts. And get a judgment for the two hundred and fifty thousand dollar deductible, and file it against your unit. So you may end up losing your unit over the fact that you didn't buy insurance. Okay, so then, so, uh, 同大家分享就系话咧，唔好唔买，唔好唔好悭。即係一句講曬啦，你唔好慳。即係業主啦，係啦，房東啦嚇。係啦，即係如果你搞搞咗真係你你你冇知道你冇嘅時候咧，係個立案法團係可以去法庭嗰度咧，啊、嗯、去即係申請誒、呃，即係如果你話真係要二十五萬墊底費咧，你就可能 end up 咧，你就要賣賣咗個單位嚟到俾依個墊底費咁樣樣㗎啦。Okay, so before、uh, we have one and a half more minutes before our next commercial breaks,、uh, so I would like to ask is that、um, if、um, you know like、uh, is there any progress? Being made in making it a regulations that insurance companies have to give a renewal quote thirty days prior to expiry of a current policy. I don't know how how short you can give this.、Uh, um, you know before our、uh, commercial. 嗯，咁啊，阿 Tina 問咗個問題啦，因為而家咧好多保險公司，我哋聽翻嚟咧，係個保險嘅到期咧，只話俾你聽，你做保同埋保費幾多，同埋墊底費幾多嘅。咁喺條例上，而家其實政府有冇做緊一啲工作咧，就令到啲保險公司一定要俾三十日時間嗰個誒業主立法團考慮佢個誒保險嘅條款啊，即係需唔需要喺三誒喺個到期三十日之前一定要通知業主立法團咧 ？Yes, Tony. So there, there are many discussions happening at a provincial government level right now 
um, that relate to the insurance broker, not the insurance company. So the insurance companies are on a free enterprise system and, and it's impossible almost to regulate how and when they have to provide quotes. It's the responsibility of the brokers who are basically representing those companies to meet some of those conditions. So yeah, things like um, uh, time periods, you know, 30 days uh, prior to expiry or 14 days, you know, giving notice to the strata corporations. That is definitely being discussed. Uh, what also is being discussed is a mandatory disclosure of any types of fees or commissions that are being paid to other parties by the insurance brokers. So fees and commissions um, are now frequently being paid to management companies who bring their clients insurance policies, but those fees and commissions are not being disclosed to their clients. So ah. that's being discussed to make that mandatory. And then the other change that's being looked at closely is changing the description of what is covered under the strata policy inside the unit because now with so many luxury buildings, the finishings inside the units can almost constitute three hundred dollars to $500,000 of value the strata has to insure, even though they don't own the property. Okay, mm. okay, I understand, I understand. So, uh, okay. uh, yeah, we're going to translate that later on, <laughs> because right now we get into the commercial. Okay. Great. So, so guys, um, hi. I'm just saying hi, Tony, to to the realtors that is watching, uh, the uh, the the Facebook live right now. So, if you have any questions, guys, uh, that you're watching, so if you wish to quickly let me know and um, feel free to type it as, so that I, I try to uh, to ask Tony uh, uh, right now but um, Tony so what because this is just like what the realtors right now that we have to you know we have to for, for years that we now we have to disclose our commission to our clients so that's basically what is going on right yeah yeah exactly you know you sell a five hundred thousand dollar condo and you have to disclose every commission fee that you earn and that you may pay to anybody else we, we don't know why in the insurance industry and within the management industry why this is ever any different. An insurance policy is $1.5 million. There's certainly commissions in there. Of course. Um, why is it? Why does the client not get to know what commissions are being paid? That okay, so we're coming back for that. Yeah, we're coming back for that right now. Thank you. Yeah. Sorry about that. That's okay. Free 有一個discussion,但是就沒有一個結論,是關於譬如說十幾日,十四日或者三十日,所以這個情況之下就未知道是一定要這樣做,但是在那個discussion中間的。So uh, 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 Tony, I just want to quickly ask you, uh, you mentioned that uh, the, uh, the discussion is going on between the provincial governments uh, as well as the, um, uh, the insurance company about asking the brokers to, to, to disclose maybe 14 to 30 days, you know, um, do you know where is at right now? Do you know if there's anywhere you know comes to a conclusion soon? Yes, Tony. Well, I think that unless we dynamically change how insurance is provided in British Columbia, this problem won't be solved because you basically have mm -hmm. a private corporation providing insurance 
there is nothing you can do to force them to provide an insurance quote earlier or later. They're just going to simply provide it based upon the risk that they manage, the market, the worldwide market. And of course, right now with the worldwide market essentially dropping so much, the profits for these companies are going to be even more affected. So it's, it's going to be even that much more difficult to get that level of cooperation from the companies. I think everyone's managing their risks to the very last moment. And so unless we change how we do insurance in British Columbia, I don't think we're going to see a solution very soon. OK， 咁啊啊啊 Tony 嘅意思咧就係即係你你你都唔好望啦，因為咧始終係私人企業啦，咁咧就政府嗰度咧就好難咧去去誒即係規定佢哋點做，尤其是而家即係而家嗰個經濟狀況啦，全球經濟狀況，咁佢哋因為 clean 得太多啊，因為嗰啲啊即係我哋。啊、uh, ，好多啲 mother nature 又好，點都好啦 ，clean 即係 clean 得太多嘅時候咧，所以咧變咗佢哋嗰個即係銀紙又好啊，即係即係佢哋可能喺佢哋嘅心目中唔係賺得咁多啦，咁所以咧、mm -hmm. 想佢哋合作咧嘅機會咧就都幾難啊。Mm -hmm. So I guess 啊、uh, ，Tony， then if that is the key situation， it's like anything， OK， don't 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 have any hope， 啊、uh, from anybody， like the government， insurance company or whatever， as a strata council as the building。It's better that we help ourselves. Okay, we help ourselves, meaning that the Strata Council has to be very proactive to make sure that we maintain our building up to date, up to par, so that you know when anything, you know, like we try to minimize the risk. Would that be a fair statement? Yeah,那啊啊啊，大家都暫時冇乜希望噶啦，政府又好啊，本公司都好，都冇乜希望啦，覺得而家嘅現狀啦。咁啊，而家業主立法權嚟講啦，不如自救啦嚇。咁其實
堅誒冇、呃、堅守，即係冇冇話一定要我哋去誒花、呃、錢出嚟去儲呢一筆錢。嗯、所以咧，而家即係誒，正所謂頭痛醫頭，腳痛醫腳啦。咁呢度病咧就就攞啲錢出嚟，嗰度病攞啲錢出嚟。但係咧，我哋其實一做咧就係應該誒俾我哋依邊咧就係即係肯攞多啲錢出嚟嘅時候咧，咁有依個嘅 emergency 嘅時候咧，就大家可以去維修一樣，誒做維修啦、嗯。So Tony, as far as I know, um, uh, for Strata. Fee in、um, Ontario in in Toronto, they have always been much higher than us. Like for years、yeah. ago, like five six years ago, I know that、uh, they're like seventy cents per square foot. Whereas here, we still have up to date. We still have some strata building. It's only twenty five per twenty five cents per square foot. Thirty cents per square foot. Even the luxury condo, you know, you, you're looking at maybe you know sixty, seventy cents a square foot, and then we're screaming, like you said, because our stra,、uh, our our market is so expensive, and 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 that makes us, you know, like the cost. So I want to、um, uh, have this uh, uh, to 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 get it from you know your your insight after、uh, it can translate it into、um, Cantonese. 嗱，咁啊講到 strata fee 啦，管理費之誒嗰個問題咧，咁啊阿天娜就話啦，要知道多倫多咧嗰啲管理費咧就特別貴嘅，貴到我哋好多嘅，好多年㗎啦已經，好多年㗎啦，七毫子一尺㗎，係啊，七毫子一尺，好多年前已經係㗎啦。我哋呢邊咧都係兩毫半啊，三毫子啊，就算豪宅啊，啊都係六六毫子一尺㗎啫，咁我哋已經呱呱叫㗎啦。係啦，咁其實呢個情況會唔會有啲問題咧嚇 ？Yeah, so so what is your insight, Tony? So a lot of that has to do with Because they have to fund their reserve funds for the long term, and so that you know, if you start a new building from the first day, if you contributed somewhere between a hundred and a hundred and twenty-five dollars a month per unit just to your reserves, you will probably have a sufficient amount of money for your future repairs and emergencies. But the problem is, most properties are only contributing. About thirty or forty dollars a month,、oh, and that's、okay. one of the challenges, right? And so we're way underfunded,、mm -hmm. both for long-term planning, but also for annual service contracts and maintenance and inspections and warranty inspections. And you know, it, it, when the new development starts, the developer sets the fees as low as possible to make the property attractive and affordable. Okay, now, uh, very simple. We need to be cheap. 呢、这個咧就係我哋中國人話真係又要平又要又又要買而好又要買而不吃草啊 ！OK， 咁即係話咧誒誒，安安大略省嗰邊咧就係話佢哋就算係一個新嘅大廈咧，由第一日開始咧，佢哋每個單位咧就會俾一百誒一百到百一百二十五蚊每個月咧，就係將呢筆錢咧係儲喺度嘅。OK， 咁但係 BC 省咧，我哋淨係三十到四十蚊嘅啫一個月，咁所以變咗咧，我哋呢個情況之下咧就非常之 underfund 嗱，即係即係嗯，即係有誒有個基金不足。係啊，基金不足啦，咁、嗯、所以變咗就而家咧，焗住我哋自己要承受嗰啲<笑>結果啦，結果啦 ，right？ So last last questions I want to ask you, ah,、uh, because we 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 only have two minutes left, one one and a half. Um, as a realtor, as ah、uh, as ah、uh, as an owner, um, can you give us like three to five points, whatever points you can give us? What do we need to do? I mean, like, if, is there a place that we can call? If we have questions like a helpline, and and then、uh, you know what kind of questions do we need to ask, and、uh, so that we as a realtor can do our best job to protect our seller as well as the buyers, and then and then we also have to 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 protect ourselves because we have the E N O. 嗯，咁啊，而家個阿天娜一個經紀嚟噶啦嚇，咁對住一個誒、呃、業主啦，咁啊想問下阿通明嘅意見啊，其實有啲咩地方可以問到一啲查詢到啲問題咧？我可以，譬如一個誒、呃、經紀嚟講，可以問到啲咩問題，可以保障到嗰個賣家或者賣家咧？啊、uh, ，yes，so first，so best best answer to start for giving this data. You can always call our toll-free number. We have a number of advisors who will get back to you. If you're an agent, an owner, a strata council member, a property manager, we're happy to help everyone.、Um, uh, so the Choa number is on the Choa website. Yeah.、Um, it's a toll-free number, and you can choose any one of the advisors to speak to. Okay, great. Um, um, okay. So, and then the other thing, as a realtor, if, if you're doing a listing or you're representing somebody who's purchasing. Ask for a copy of the insurance. Ask if they have a copy of their claims history, which is also important because it will impact the renewal of the insurance.
ask if they have a depreciation report, and then look at when this policy renews. Because if this policy renews next month on March 1st, it may be that the policy itself could substantially change between now and the listing or the purchase. So it's helpful to know when the policy is going to renew as well as what the current terms are. Okay, so I'm, I have to quickly, uh, uh, um, we, we, we cannot translate much. Uh, the show is over, but then the realtors can stay on because I, I will just carry on with that. Yeah, Great. So, Tony, uh, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Uh, but actually, I have one more question because we're on this uh, FaceTime, uh, Facebook Live, so I don't need to worry about the, the, the Chinese listener right now. We do have one more question. We don't have one more question uh, from an agent. An agent says that once we have a subject deal, what measure of due diligence do we recommend us do you recommend us to do to ensure that particular strata will be able to renew their strata insurance? There is no way of guaranteeing that. Um, you know, an agent, the buyer may put that in as a subject to renewal of insurance. That could be a potential subject that a buyer might now start to be thinking about. Um, uh, but, you know, I, if that's a serious concern, my recommendation is that the agent with the broker in their office and they might need to talk to the real estate council or talk to your legal counsel to see what kind of risks exist on this deal. Um, it, 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 there is no guarantee right now that um, the building will get 100% insurance, insurance or what the limits to the cost might be. And of course the bigger problem is if the insurance increases, um, what is it going to increase by? 100%, 300%, 500%? You don't, until you know that, it's very difficult to predict what the future costs and the risks for this new buyer are going to be. Okay, thank you so very much. Thank you so very much, guys, uh, realtors, friends, uh, colleagues. Uh, I hope this is helpful and sorry about this uh, uh, music behind the scene because I'm just out of my control right now. But um, thank you so much. Uh, we'll stop right there. But uh, I'll, when I say thank you to Tony again. Bye, guys. Thank you.